zone. New Apple iOS updates has been uh, the bane of our existence. Oh, it's meant to be in white. GG. Do you want to show your shot from up there? You know where to find us now. Hey guys, welcome to today's video. Uh, I'm really excited to go through what we have in store for you today. Now, I'm excited to show you everything that we do here at Top Tier Marketing, the kind of spaces, the meeting rooms, and what we're all about. One of the things that you're going to get to notice about us is that the entire office here is heavily predicated around culture. Now, this is consistent with why we installed the basketball hoop, why we have the particular pieces of art that we have hang hanging up on the wall. I truly believe that the office space should represent you. What is your business standing for? You know, what are your interests? What is your team interested in? And it shouldn't necessarily always follow a beach theme or you know, uh, something that some other brand had done. It has to represent what you truly believe in. So with me, I love basketball. So we have a basketball hoop. We have pictures and art pieces of Kobe Bryant and Michael Jordan on the wall. I love movies, so we have Wolf of Wall Street up on the wall as well. I love what that movie represents. I love the tenacity and the, and the business aspect of that entire movie. That's what I'm all about. So that's why we have uh, pieces like that on the wall. All cylinders are firing within this agency. So as we walk through the office, you'll see that you know, you've got different teams in different meetings talking to either Facebook reps or talking to clients. Okay, so this is the front entrance. Uh, what we've done here is tried to make it as, I guess, home feeling as possible so we've got the of course very important sign up the top which has been super cool to get that delivered uh, custom neon sign shout out to you guys and to have that kind of represent our agency uh, nice leather couch just nice I guess front entrance room really uh, we didn't do anything with the wall so this kind of just was here when we first came in so it's a nice little aesthetic piece if you can ignore the dead plants we have a bit of a plan on what we want to do here so essentially we work with e-commerce brands and we want to display all of their products in this little shop section so what we want to do is have like a a little like shop icon thing up there and have like a clothes horse with uh, all of our clients, you know, dresses or tops. And then we've kind of already started to build it out with some hats, uh, you know, beard oils, hammocks and stuff like that as well. If you're a young business owner, you respect the, the Wolf of Wall Street. Okay, so this is our open floor space. This is essentially where our entire team works. We have three meeting room offices up here and then of course, yeah, the open floor plan. Now, one of the things that we did was we didn't go the direction of having private offices. I think when you're trying to build an agency, it's really, really important to make sure that there is the ability for everybody to communicate freely. But that can also go against you sometimes as well because you know if everybody's talking all the time, uh, you can't really get any work done. So. We do things like implement uh, hours where we can essentially just have quiet time and nobody disturbs anybody. If you need to talk to somebody, jump on Slack. But uh, other than that, it's just trying to smash out the bits of work that you need to get done. Okay, so one thing that we did get going within our agency is of course a really uh, important meeting room, which is our boardroom. So this is what our boardroom looks like. Currently, Laura and Maddie in there now having a meeting with our Facebook reps. And I'm gonna open the door. I'll be very quiet, but you guys can jump in and uh, have a look at what they're doing. Is it good, Manny? What are you guys talking about? Just about the new iOS 14 update and the conversion API. Ah. And then it's for Bunny's account. Okay, I know. So that's something that a lot of agencies have been hit with uh, recently at the start of this year. I'll leave you guys alone, thank you. New Apple iOS updates has been uh, the bane of our existence, but also a blessing in disguise, I think. Uh, a lot of changes coming with the way we report our data. So that's what that call's all about. Now in here, uh, what we have is our graphic design room. So this just got fitted out. And essentially the overall goal is to have our agency div diversify all of its services. So we wanna make sure that, you know, we're not just doing Facebook ads, but facilitating the content side of things as well. So our plan is to have two content creators in here making the coolest content in the world that's gonna heavily increase the conversions on our ads. Something you'll start to notice around these videos as we go through each room is the art pieces that we have up on the wall. So I'm all about making sure that our culture is matched uh, amongst our office. So we have really cool pieces, shout out to DG Designs. Uh, we have 
have Jeremy Piven, uh, Ari Gold from the Entourage, and then of course we have the GOAT here, Michael Jordan as well. I'm a massive basketball fan, so have a couple of those pieces lying around. Okay, so you can kind of see there's a lot of stuff going on. We have another meeting going on in this room, which is our second meeting room, and this is Mark. Uh, he's on a call with his client at the moment and running through things like strategy, uh, making sure that you know we're achieving good results. And this is something that we do, you know, month on month with every single one of our clients to make sure we're you know hitting the results that each of the brands that we're working with is needing to be hitting. So that's really important and that's what Mark's doing in there. One thing that I've learned with my own experience of trying to build a business is that you need to give responsibilities out to other people so that it can operate without you. Now, I have a mindset of building a business like you're gonna sell it. So you need to take away key aspects of reliance from me and put it onto other people. So that's why we have people running their own calls, uh, managing their own clients, uh, they have their own Facebook reps, and it allows the business to run autonomously. In our kitchen, some of the essentials, coffee machine number one, uh, toaster, an air fryer, a sandwich maker, microwave, and a little mini fridge, which is getting filled up too much with the amount of people that are coming into this business. So we need to get a bigger fridge uh, in the next couple of weeks. So that's our kitchen, that's our bathroom as well. Okay, so that is like the mezzanine area. That's like where all the action happens currently. Now, within this office space, we have this massive warehouse all down below and we need to utilize a lot more of this space Currently what it's great for is uh, a basketball court. Uh, we have spike ball going on, we've got table tennis, and then uh, we have our lunch down here as well. But our plan is to utilize the space more, especially as the business grows. But that was our biggest thing when we got this office, because we needed a space that we were going to grow into. We didn't want, just want to buy a space that fitted us currently at this current time. We've literally since moved into this office, doubled the amount of staff, and we plan to do that in the next six to 12 months as well. So we wanted to make sure that we have a place that can facilitate that growth. It's really important that the guys the place that they're coming into each and every day is a place that they enjoy. So, you know, that's why we created and, and built in things like the basketball hoop, like spike ball, like table tennis, you know. It's sick stuff to have around the office, but at the same time, when it comes down to lunchtime, when guys need a break, let off a bit of steam, these things are there for them to do that. So, it's really important. I'm a massive basketball player. Uh, if this doesn't go in, then we'll edit it to make it look like it. First try. I don't know what you need from me, but that's where it's going. That's top tier? That's top tier. Entrance? Yep. And then Where's we- the entrance? Right here. That one is the entrance? So it's gonna be put up, yeah, just right above here. Cool. Which would be sick. Um, and then the, you're doing the quote as well today, right? Yep. On the inside? Yep. Unreal. Okay, cool. So that's gonna go on that back wall there. Yep. So I'll, right. I'll show you. Oh, it's meant to be in white. Don't tell me that. Nah, I'm only kidding. <laughs> Mate, after this week? <laughs> Uh, that's funny. So that's your back. It's got double sided tape on it. I'll put some glue on it. Crazy. Yep. Unreal. So Looks that, great. That's for your entrance. And then we've got the, the 10 tier. mil for your top tier. Yeah, wicked. Right. Jeez, that's so, bigger. Very yeah. exciting. So that's a quote on the inside, um, which you'll see in a sec. And then, yeah, above here, we're finally going to slap the top tier name on the building, which is. I think a big moment. Uh, I'm, I'm truly, truly excited about it. And when it get, gets up there, I think it might be a, a bit of a surreal moment. So I'm excited. We good? We got any show? Just a quick look. 100%. Only on this one because it's not set. Sick. <laughs> How good does that look? Unreal. Yeah, nah, it's perfect. So if you haven't noticed, this curse word is uh, faded out. So that looks perfect. All to the right side, unreal. Nah, that'll look epic. So it does. Okay, so one thing I touched on in one of my older videos, which is predicated all around team culture. This afternoon, like I kind of said before, we're gonna go do a team event, which is punishment for not hitting budget. Now, within any business, it's vital that you keep your team motivated and working towards something. For example, one of the things that we do here is we build a lot of our KPIs around like budget and make sure that each month the business is progressively hitting budget and growing. And we also have like a punishment. Now, even though it's punishment and you know, as a business owner, I might be a little bit up, 
upset, I guess, around, you know, not hitting budget. I guess I'm always looking at opportunities within everything that we do and with everything that we're implementing within the business. You know, we got a, we got a, a young team. We'll go out, we'll organize drinks, uh, we'll celebrate, and we'll make sure that the guys know that they feel like they aren't that for that month. So team culture is very, very vital, and I can't wait for you guys to see a little bit more about uh, what we do here this afternoon. Do you want to get it on camera, your jump shot? No, I, I didn't even do one. I, <laughs> Do you want to show your shot from up there? <laughs> Mark, Mark claims he never misses that shot. I've done one bad one. If you get it on camera, that's going to be cool, hey? Oh! <laughs> there you go. Alright. <laughs> that looks sick. Unreal. The reason why we got that on is because the amount of people that we had coming through uh, delivering, I don't know, packages or whatever would be like looking at this building like it's a big fortress and there's that door, there's that door, there's this big door. I did the same thing to be honest. Yeah. So now if we have another person come through not knowing where to go, we know it's not us anymore, it's them. See, the top stroke of the T should finish about there somewhere. Yeah. So, and then, where's the... It'll be the same over here. Yeah. About, roughly about there. Unreal. Big. Thank you. Okay. Uh, we'll head off now, but we'll be back in a, an hour. I swear. I swear. I swear. for my wins. I need my hands. This life is real. If they pretend. Ain't more the I get it in. I get it in. I get it in. Get for my wins. I miss my baby, so I hit them on the FaceTime. I need it all for them, so no, I cannot waste time. Facing these oceans, feel the water on my waistline. We trust the process, and I only know it takes time. Look at that, bro. GG. How good's that look? You know where to find us now. <laughs> Insane. Entrance, top tier. So sick. Um, can I get a couple photos in front of it? Almost like overwhelming how much I'm learning from each and every one of you. So, mm -hmm. really happy with everyone. Thank you. Awesome. Right. Let's go do some punishment. Let's do it. Do it. wrapped up our session here at the Strength Collective. It's currently 3 p.m. on a Friday and that was an insane session. I am absolutely gassed, I'm so pleased. We did like a 30 minute session. Again, punishment for not hitting this, uh, this month's budget. I think I speak for everybody when I say we do not want to go through that again. I really hope you enjoyed today's video all around the office tour. A little bit more of an insight around, you know, what we do here at Top Tier Marketing. If you haven't already, make sure you like, subscribe to the channel if you're watching on LinkedIn. Make sure you leave a comment down below. I want to be predicating a lot of these videos around what you guys want to see. Other than that, I will see you in the next video. Peace.